Hi everybody, I'm Santiago and in today's video I'm gonna show you how to make your boring, unorganized, ineffective notes into productive, aesthetic and multi-purpose notes using OneNote. So let's get to it. Okay, before we do any type of serious work, of course you have to first download the app and install it. But the thing is that using the app as it comes right out of the installation process only gets you to these types of notes. And how do I say this politely? They look awful. So let's improve them in three easy steps. Step number one, we need some fonts. Fonts are such a small thing, yet they drastically change the look of your notes. Just adding them here and there for your headings makes a world of a difference and it just takes a couple of seconds from your time. To install them, just go to 1001 free fonts, search the one you're looking for, download, double click, install, reboot, and that's it. The font you're seeing at the moment is called Chiwi and it works great to make your notes pop, but I'll leave some of my other top choices over here so you can check them out and install them for yourself to see if they fit your aesthetics. Step number two is using PNGs or images without background. You see OneNote has this awesome feature in which you can drag an image and make it part of the background. By using this tool you can write over literally anything you can imagine. Whiteboards, iPads, sticky notes, computers, you name it. This works great for highlighting important information, setting the tone of the message, and overall just making everything look nicer and easier to find. Searching for the PNGs in Google Images is quite easy, but uh, to make your life easier, I'll leave a Google Drive link in the description with some of my favorite PNGs that I use all the time so you can get started. Finally, step number three is having an organization system. Because you can have all of the fonts and PNGs you like, but if your notes are disorganized, they're just gonna look awful and finding information will be so much harder. Now, there are plenty of organization systems out there. The one I recommend and use is a two-axis note-taking system, where you place all of the headings vertically and fill them with information horizontally. This system works great in OneNote, since you can take full advantage of the infinite space available for you. The system has other learning benefits as well, but I discuss them a little bit more thoroughly in my How I Learn Medicine video, which I'll leave somewhere in the corner and in the description for you to check that out. Finally, I'd like to share that if you use these steps correctly, you can use your very same notes to present in front of your class. In fact, OneNote has many advantages that other traditional presentation apps like PowerPoint lack, such as letting you have total control over what's being displayed letting you move freely across the space and zooming in and out at will. To give you a taste of what a presentation using just one note looks like, I'll leave one of my online Spanish medical lectures over here so you can check that out. Anyways, that was it for the video. If you found it useful and want me to continue uploading more free content such as this one for you, all you need to do to support the channel is leave a like. Thanks for tuning in and I'll see you guys in the next video.